Look at this guy just running back and forth here. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. Hello and welcome back to a very special episode of TFS Plays Pokemon Leaf Green Nuzblock. I am Latios Pator. I forgot my name, I'm Kieran. I'm Lily Grant. I know I've said that before, but... And uh, this, this one's gonna be a bit odd because, uh, Kieran, do you, do you have a, uh, okay, just to explain it. An explanation. We, uh, we are re-recording this after the fact, and uh, we aren't playing right now. We're just no. watching the footage and commentating over it. Look, this is where we got lost in the elevator. So we do know everything that happens, but why we're doing this is because <laughs> the audio that we recorded last time, for whatever reason, it did not go to the proper microphone. It's completely fucked, but I, I can only say so much. Kieran, would you like to give them an example of like what's going on right now? Now. Absolutely! So we sound like this. Hello and welcome back to TFS Plays Pokemon League Green Nuzlocke! Which isn't good, <laughs> and we figured that nobody would want to listen to that for a long period of time. I mean, who would want to listen to this? Shit, I not have a name! I'm I win! Uh, when you could be listening to us talking like this. Exactly. God, my ears! <laughs> It's, oh god, I went, I put it on and I was like, there's, no, it did not do this. I think it recorded through the webcam instead of our actual yeah, microphone. Yeah, that's the, it's the only other microphone I can think of, it's, unless it was recording through a pair of headphones. I was gonna say, <laughs> that happened to me once, it freaked me out, because I didn't know headphones could do that. You know, so given the quality, I yeah. would not be surprised. So we're running back around Sylph Tower, and uh, th th we're still desperately trying to, we're, this is the part where we're going through, like, process of elimination. Yeah. Let's like, see which of these leads where. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that one just leads this to that. That fucking room that we just opened. Perfect. Yeah, perfect. Right, okay, right. so at least that. And then so oh, we do know that. everything that's coming up, uh, but I have forgotten literally all of it except for the death. Why would you drop that so soon? Yeah, because on, it keeps people on the edge of their Ooh, seats. Okay, you know what? Fine. It's called yeah. foreshadowing, aka an article I saw where it says movies that spoiled themselves. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, come on! Do you not know this classic writing technique? <laughs> It's true, but some of them go a little bit further. I mean, it's like uh, the the movie John dies at the end. John's gonna die at the end. Surprise! Surprise! <clears throat> but, you, but the quest is how he gets there. Yeah. Yeah. The One Piece is the journey that whole time. Yeah. It's mm -hmm. fine. So, Karen, what were you thinking at this point? I was thinking, no, I think. Fuck! We gotta find this goddamn we path. <laughs> no, we were thinking we just exhausted everything on floor two, so now it's check floor three. Which well, but then it took us right back here. down to floor two. I was like, okay, fuck that one, and then we just start. Meandering about and going, did we go in this one? Uh, I don't know. We like probably went in this one. That guy was locked in that door, but he's in a teleporter. Like, and it's was... right next to him. Yeah. He could have just easily <laughs> escaped out and of opted that room. not to. No, he could Because Rocket had Rocket had this place. Oh, and yeah, here's where we found the nut sack. So yeah, we and this is where we got a little bit of apprehension, because it's like, well, we've used up a lot of our shit. Uh, 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 uh what do we have to use? Let's heal somebody. This low level, I am sure Nutsack is going to be in. Yeah, nutsack, no Walk problem. In the park. No problem. Everybody else here, sub 30s. Yeah. I mean, oh, come on. Yeah. But we How had, bad could we it had be? exhausted some PP at this point, I think. Yeah, so we decided to dig through, I believe, uh, three or four stories. Oh, wait, no. Did no, we just... it's, no, it's later. Oh, did we dig later? <laughs> I think. I think I, it's after someone else. Like I said, I forgot like most everything that happened. I think this is the part where we were arguing about who should go first and if we should give Sandrew leftovers. Uh, yeah, this is, this like, is well, that he's gonna, question. He's going to start with Pidgeot, and we were like, well, we've got Rock Slide, and Sandrew's also got good defense, so he's probably the best bet. Yeah, and Wanda is like, okay, Wanda needs some levels. Does she need leftovers? Okay, and no. it's like, yeah, whatever. Wanda, if Wanda has to go in, she'll be fine. Yeah. So, uh, here's us going up against Nutsack. Horribly underleveled Nutsack. Oh. No no chance in hell of him having anything good whatsoever. Yeah. How could he possibly stand to us? I also like that there's this hostage situation. And he, the most he, important thing to him was like, I've got to battle my friend for oh, town. Oh, wait, what's this? A level 37? Why, that is a little out of the ordinary. That's a little higher than we expected. Uh, he dances for us, just to intimidate us. I remember being really scared because I couldn't remember what Feather Dance did. I was like, are we like paralyzed or something? No. And this is where I got confused because every other attack, like every other, like Rock Slide is physical according to you, right? Yes. But Bite, bite is, special. is special. That's so fucking weird to me. It's 
it's all based on type. It it's is like a dark so, type move. It is special. So yeah, yeah, luckily our boy Sandrew is able to take care of him. No problem. <laughs> no problem whatsoever. However, not that Blastoise. Not not the Blastoise. Blastoise is like, ah, you know what? I don't think we want him in there. No. And they're like, okay, so that Pidgey, that Pidgeot was level 30, 38. And something in the So, like, yeah, Quads, Quads you know, yeah. our next highest level yeah, dude. Has, wave. has a lightning move, electric move, whatever, can, can do this. Oh! 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 He's level 40. So about that death. <laughs> it's gonna that be. death I was talking about, it's 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 not a good death. No, it's a little kind of our fault, maybe. Possibly. We probably because probably uh, there's a movie oh, hat that it, 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 it wasn't right here. Uh, it was not, not yet. Here. It did not happen yet. No. Uh, so don't even worry about it. Close, that being said, we had to move him out. <laughs> we had to, had to change up plans here. So uh, we thought, Bork! If anybody's gonna chew through something, they're gonna have to get through a lot of the fat, so we'll be okay. And look at him, he's rapid spin, like, he, like what's he doing? No, 10 damage. He thought we were some sort of noble trainer that refuses to switch and lets our Pokemon die. No, no, that's for him. No, that's so for he him. spins into us, he's gonna be like, no, you're not allowed to do that, I'm gonna protect myself. And we and almost Bork's did like, Hyper Beam <laughs> But we then. did not do that. But we didn't. So good, good call me. That was my call. Yeah. Uh, I'm the best that being here. said, Blastoise's defense probably would have held steadfast against Hyper Beam to begin with. Probably. So, you know, let's just German this bastard and break his goddamn neck, oh, is good. what I'm saying. Good, good. So now he's he's on a stretcher. He should have ducked into the shell. He's on a stretcher crying, <laughs> like, please don't kill me. He can't even do And the of course, Bork doesn't hear <laughs> shit. Hey, hold on, what's this audio sound like? Bork! <laughs> Mmm, glorious. Ooh, beautiful. Crispy. Love it. <laughs> Don't wanna. <sighs> yeah. <laughs> it's so bad. It's so bad. I like that that is like the worst. And not to mention you went out of town the next day. Yeah. So there was no way to fix no, that yeah. right no, away. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, no one knew, so it was just sitting there sounding terrible. But hey, we're here, we're here, fam. We got we got the hookup, we got you. We got that puppy scaring Wanda. Oh, of course, yeah. Real. But it's okay. We'll just drown the puppy. <laughs> just yeah. What do you What do you do? What do you do with a scary puppy? You drown it. <laughs> yeah, that's what you do with a scary Throw puppy. Throw it in a bag. Find the nearest river. It's done. Problem solving. <laughs> Fill it with concrete. There you go. <laughs> and then we got an execute coming up. And we're just like, you know what? Fuck it. Let's Grass light that. Type, huh? Let's light that some bitch on fire. That's right. You know. Light that sweet, sweet coop. Scramble these eggs. <laughs> Grass type? Man, sounds like fire flying has a good advantage. Uh, excuse you, I think you mean he's plant type. Ah, you're right. Thank you. And toasty. Get out of here. Extra crispy. Easy peasy. Nothing could possibly go wrong before the end of this fight. Absolutely not. No chance no. in hell. <clears throat> oh, oh, oh. oh. He's got Mr. Two Spoons. He he's got a lot of he has uh he has Quinn Quinn S. Like, so well, I'm pretty sure we send Bork or Wanda because Wanda has bite. No, like Bork this is where we the good, the Gork, yeah. Bork, yeah. Bork has the good special defense. Yeah, we were arguing between Bork and Wanda. Yeah, because I was like, our quads the shockwave. Nothing says. It's yeah, but uh, we had to teach it shockwave. That's true. But I just wanted to throw the possibility out there. That Which it was can fair. Learn electric moves. And Bork is just fine. I mean, Bork's. Oh, yeah. oh no, he looked into the future and he saw his doom. But he foresaw an attack. What is it? Boom. It was a it was a German suplex. <laughs> I was like, oh, okay. Um, um. But uh, it failed. Uh, uh, he can't see anything because he, he is dead. And that was the death I was referring to earlier. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's damp gone. Or it was, was it? Dead. No, tension gone. <laughs> <laughs> People should know better than to trust me. Oh, I know. We don't trust them, they don't trust us, it works both ways. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's and so now, Nutsack, the valiant hero, coming in here trying to well, save anyways, everybody. You this just leave! Yeah, it's just like, you have fun saving these people, bye. He was essentially on the side of Team Rocket there. I want to <laughs> yeah. point that out. <laughs> yeah. You're gonna go fight the boss of Team Rocket, let me weaken you a bit. Yeah. And <laughs> hey, you want to save all these people? Fuck you for being noble! Oh, good. This is where we got oh, our Lapras. I was so excited. Laugh her ass. And I, I, like I, love, I, no, I remember I remember positing Nessie is too easy. Nessie yeah. was too easy. Uh, and I can't remember what we ended up going with. <laughs> so this will be a surprise to me. No, uh, what's your name? What's we, your name we, right now? We said Lady of the Ocean, I believe, was our was our prompt. Ariel? A? Uh, a? Uh, a uh, April? A April! April. Oh, April. Favorite, favorite, Ninja Turtle! Favorite yes, yes turtle. because I was because we said like, okay, what about the Ninja Turtles? And you're like, April, April O'Neil. I'm like, well, okay, I guess it's better than Venus to Milo. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 
live action turtles fans, you don't exist. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, they, speak, they do. Speaking to you really, right the now, Sentai like... Turtle Team? Yeah, they do. Because they teamed up with Power Rangers in space in one episode. <laughs> I remember that. Yeah, I was gonna say there is there is an episode of Power Rangers of the Turtles crossover too. Because when we were talking about Dynasty Warrior games and we mentioned uh, Power Rangers, one people were like, "Hey, in the Power Rangers universe, turtles are canon. Yeah, so that means they can show up and soak in all their villains." So that's that's like, right. That would Fair actually enough. be pretty cool. <laughs> that would be pretty cool. I'd be okay with the Power Rangers and the Turtles teaming up. Uh, poor little keybone, sorry. Snap. Sorry, you, you get snapped. <clears throat> he's he's gonna be like, oh no, I don't like you! He's like, I'm getting pumped! If you let me live this next turn, I'm gonna haul. Oh, oh, too bad the snap. It's too, it's too powerful. And then I think this is when we started talking about what happens if a diglet uses dig. <laughs> That's like a snap. Snap. Oh, yeah, snap. 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 Yeah. A snap. 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 But then, but, it, but then once it but, evolves, it loses it. Yeah, it, it, it loses the end. Yeah. Well, now it's Doug. Just like just like San is San San Shrew. San Shrew does not get a bonus from Slash. No. Yeah. No. I don't think he even learned. He gets he actually. gets a bonus from Sand Attack, but I mean, what what does that do? Yeah. Really? No, great. Your exactly. accuracy is just a little bit worse than it was. <laughs> now combine that with Bork Laser doing his dance that we haven't done yet. <laughs> or have we? Have we done Double Team yet? I don't think he's. Used We've done it, it once. Oh, we did. It, we did it during Koga. Yeah, once. that's right, we did. <sighs> totally unnecessary, but we did it. Oh, it was fun. We had to do it. It was a show of power. <laughs> Put this figure Johnny Cash could use a little bit of love. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Some level up. We've been, like, we've been rock solid with freezing people solid. I know. Oh, yeah, geez. I know. Like, every, time, I, like, every other time we I always thought that was... that was the rarest like, status effect. I mean, it has the same, like... Possibility, as but how like often have you yeah, seen but, it? Yeah, but, but, but there's no yeah, move but, that yeah, is just dedicated. There's no to one move that's just freeze this guy. Yeah, there's no equivalent of thunder wave for frozen. And the thing is, I don't remember, and maybe it's always been possible, but I don't remember if getting thawed out like naturally <laughs> ever that, happened. Well, no, like it definitely does now. But I don't know if it's like been since Gen One that you could get thawed out because I feel like I remember like I remember, if you got frozen in Gen One, it was just well this Pokemon's essentially fainted. Yeah, like, I remember like, that too because like the bur like the freeze heals were like who who fucking cares about that? And then when it happened, I was like oh shit, <laughs> fucking Dugong. <laughs> Here we are giving the iron yeah. I think to Bork or Johnny. I think Bork because we were like because no Kangaskhan was coming up. We we're like he's gonna yeah. have a fucking Kangaskhan and it's gonna be terrible. So we gave it to Johnny. Yeah, we give yeah. one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> because Bork, like, we I was figured say, I Bork think that was, was your out. argument. And I was like, we wouldn't keep him out against the fighting type. That would hurt fighting type. Yeah, we wouldn't, yeah, we wouldn't keep Bork out against Kangaskhan. We'd have somebody else in. I remember who, we were gonna, like, PP anything. No, then we were like, okay, fuck this. We're right outside this. Now we're just gonna, I think that's what we say. Yeah, we're gonna yeah, dig through we were, 11 we like, floors. We were like, we know Well, we no, I think we walked back for some reason. No, I think we're looking for the bed. We were like, yeah, yeah we were like, let's go find the bed so that we can rest. And then we were just like, Fuck that shit. Yeah. We Fuck know it. where we need to go. Yeah, at some point I was like, we know exactly which. Because we got in this we got in this elevator. We were like, and we're I like, think it was floor what floor was the bed seven? on? I think I know what it's like to watch everyone at home now when we do something stupid. Because I'm just like, what are we doing? <laughs> like, come on. Oh, we can't teleport. Guess yeah. we're digging. <laughs> well, we're gonna have to dig through three floors of this building real quick. Oh, like six floors now. No, only three. We're at, we're on floor three right I now. I thought it was the floor six. Nope, that was floor three. Because we teleported to one floor. Okay. Wee. And of course, not teleporting yet. Yeah, we're still still getting some extra. Time. Still the, weren't the using our was, speed the bike run was worth it. I mean, yeah. Which episode number is this? Do you know? Like this is thirty nine. Yeah. We start we start using our speed run strats in like episode like fifty something. Yeah. So, like don't worry, don't worry, fam. We'll get there. We get there. Yeah. We're slowly <laughs> we're slowly but surely catching up to Dumplin and ca the Captain. For how many episodes we've got? I know. I, I think we won't go as far, but <laughs> we'll see. We'll I mean, see. how many gyms do we got left? We just have, uh, we have Sabrina, and then we have, That's right. we have Blaine, and then Blaine Giovanni. Is the fire dude, right? Yeah, he is at Cinnabar. But let us, let us not forget the nightmare that is Victory Road, that... Uh, I don't remember Victor Road being so bad. It's annoying. This one's pretty bad. Is this, it really? This is the one where you have to use every HM at yeah. one point in it. Fuck so. that! <laughs> yeah, we're gonna need. We're like, luckily we have a bunch of people with we proper HM. Oh we shit! It's oh. the mob boss again. The president. I not what are you doing to in my taking up my business? What are you doing, uh, Abe? You're gonna gonna come in here on the day of my <laughs> taking over of Silco <laughs> and ask Sweating. a favor of me. The day of Silk Co's wedding. 
the day the day of Team Rock and Silco's wedding. <laughs> we're like, oh, thank goodness, we had Sandra. Because I feel like we walked up here and we're like, who do we have in front? We're like, I don't know. Oh yeah, I'm trying to look. Shit, I don't know. Oh good, he's poison type. Quest sold. We're like, oh, gone. this worked out as perfectly as it could. About as well as it could have, yeah. So I think I was looking up that poison is also always special in this. That makes mm, sense. I think poison is actually physical. Is, is it physical or special? I thought it was physical. So and here comes his Kangaskhan, the, the one that we were so worried about. Yeah, we're like, holy shit, is Kangaskhan like, What do we do? Us. What do we do? We're, we're just in there like, oh man, we can't leave Sandru in. He's got and fighting we're like, moves. Wanda, Wanda will lure, lower the attack no matter what. That yeah. is a good place to be Got in. flying, got all this shit. He'll be fine. Wanda's not a problem. Wanda got this guy. Unless he does, like, high jump kick or whatever that bullshit is. And then we're like, oh, he's level 35. What, what, what? Oh, like, what? Oh, what? Wanda That's... can handle this. Yeah, Wanda we can don't even need destroy this, this person. It's like, oh, let's do it. Come on, one head. Come can on. Obliterate. But then maybe edge it out. Writer heads prevail, I want to say. <laughs> I don't think they do. Okay, hey, <laughs> they that, did. that's all right. We're like, let's lower the let's stab HP it. a little bit first. Oh. Uh, and, and then we're like, rage. rage. Like, oh, whatever. Get what out of here. What is wrong dude. with you? Wanda's just going to eat, like, your baby and just get a little better. <laughs> give you a reason to be angry. Yeah, all we did was give that baby a bath, so then we were like, ah, eh, let's beat it up a little bit. Ruff, rough it up. Drop the edges. Good, get the Broke fucking back. Like, 10% paralysis from secret power. <laughs> oh. Ah. So scary. So you punch, you punch Wanda in the face. Like, come on. Wanda Rousey don't take that shit. Wanda and Rousey gives you the hyper beam. And I'm not going to be yelling because uh, my voice is still shredded from Friday. Oh, so. Yeah. yeah you were All of you guys, feel free to fill in for the hyper beams. <laughs> yeah, you yeah. guys got it. Everyone at home, clap your hands. Call, call in people who are in your home, your house, your apartment, your family, yeah. your children, depending on how old you are watching this, and give all of them your hyper beam demonstration. Yeah. And you know what? Love Film it. it and send it to us on how Twitter. How about don't do that? <laughs> <laughs> send us a VHS tape of your hyper beam rendition to the P.O. Box. <laughs> 365 <laughs> Addison, Texas. Seven five zero zero one. One. Yes. <laughs> if anybody sends a VHS, it better be good. Well done. It's better be some like Ringu type shit. I was gonna yeah, say, I'll, what if I'll it's the v some... VHS from the ring? Don't yeah. send us that. Yeah, no, <laughs> I'd be fine with that. No, I no. don't have a VHS player, so that shit would just go on a frame. <laughs> the, yeah, the only VHS thing I have is a broken player that I use to set up an Atari. <laughs> By the way, do you see? I, I sent you the trailer, but you see <gasps> Sadako versus Kiyako? Yes, I've seen. I saw that like when that first came out, and I was like, I hope, I hope to God, this is as cheesy and goofy as I want it to be. It looks like it with Sadako stabbing Kiyako in the eye with a <laughs> fucking like, crowbar. Yes. I was like, what the fuck is with that? Because she she watched the tape, man. What happens when a ghost watches a haunted tape? She comes after with a crowbar. <laughs> I hope it's like Freddy vs. Jason, that's all I hope. It looks like that's exactly what it is, actually. Because Freddy vs. Jason was a riot. I had a lot of fun with that movie. I would not say it's good, but it was fun. Around here is when we realize Giovanni has nothing that can hurt us, so we are no longer afraid of Yeah. Him. But then like, he oh, does no, this! Double kick, and we're like, oh man, if it did four crits in a row, we would have been in trouble. <laughs> but no, uh, whatever. We're gonna pull that queen underground, take her off the throne. <laughs> I, I, I like how Nitto Queen has those, like, breast cups. Yep. That's yeah. how you know it's female. Uh, excuse me, that's armor. And the, uh, and the lateral vagina. <laughs> yeah, just pull it up, just... <laughs> <laughs> that's, oh, that's so gross. So I've been watching a lot of Planet Earth lately, and I've been seeing way too many animal copulation. <laughs> like, more than I ever thought I had to in my lifetime. And I just want David Attenborough You've to be seen sitting there. just enough. I want David Attenborough to be sitting there going, and you'll see the snake going... Huh. <laughs> <laughs> For him to be concerned about what's going on on screen. Uh, Here you see the snake. Is that supposed to be like that? A mating coil as it just bites up. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh, good lord. My dear boy, you have given me much good tidings for saving my company. Much Why? tidings for yeah. great joy. Much good tidings of say, comfort have, and joy. Comfort and joy. So oh, tidings, tidings of comfort, comfort and joy. joy. Have a basketball. Ho, ho, ho. Lunch. Merry Christmas. <laughs> I just love this line of like, would you like to I have money, I can give you anything. Like, would you, yeah, would you like to fuck my daughter? <laughs> you could have anything. Anything. Gets on the table. Anything. <laughs> Starts unzipping. Oh. And then we just decide Which, to dig through his office. Yeah, I'm <laughs> yeah. ten. I'm getting out of here as fast as possible. You Excuse can clean this me. up, right, Prez? You said you can do anything with your money. Bye. <laughs> Bye. 
Yeah, no, give us your fucking Master Ball. Don't give us, like, millions of Pokebucks. <laughs> yeah. Well, you can't buy Can you a Master buy Ball. the Rocket Game Corner for me? Oh, I'm just, just saying, as a businessman, he should have kept the Master Ball in order to produce more. Yeah, So yes. that he could sell Here's our one-of-a-kind prototype. Please don't it's use- Oh, he threw it at and the yet every other, <laughs> And yet every other Pokemon manufacturing company across the world ends up making one <laughs> and giving them to kids. Well, see, it's kind of like how every video game console generation, they all come out with something that's relatively close to the other. Like, technology just kind of reaches that universal point. So I yeah, like to but, think that they're okay. all working on a Pokeball that doesn't fail. Yeah, but and they I, all for some reason only make one, and they're like, <laughs> "Fuck, let's give this to a kid." But I want to but I want to posit the fact that if all of these other companies can make them, that means the technology is way easier to replicate, which means that they should just be fucking available. Yeah. So one of those fuckers should be selling them. Well, it's, and all of the other Pokeballs useless. You know. Also, I feel like this is like the Master Ball is also like black market tech right now, like, this is gonna be available to the public in 30 years after the military uses it. Yeah. <laughs> like, once we can start weaponizing, like, I bet you they just want to weaponize Mewtwo first. That's, like, the first goal in the docket. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, <laughs> like, when, uh, when I Don't was worry, a... it's not like this dumbass kid's gonna find Mewtwo. Hand him the basketball, you won't use it on that. <laughs> when I was a kid, there was this lying sack of shit named Tony. <laughs> Who, uh... Tell me about Tony. Okay. He, uh... Fuck you, Tony. Yeah. He, uh... He always, like, he'd say, like, yeah, my dad works for the government. You know, you got that Pentium 4? Yeah, they got Pentium 16s already. <laughs> oh, it's, man! Yeah, so he was the, like, at Nintendo, but only yeah. of the military. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> nah, you're looking insert. at your PS2. We, we, like, they, they already got PlayStation 5. Come on. <laughs> already got PlayStation 5. I'm the government out. already got it. My, my dad knows Bill Clinton. He's got it. We hung out with his PlayStation 17. <laughs> Playing Madden, and we got a McDonald's in my yeah. face. <laughs> you, you don't know this guy yet, but like, you know, like Andrew Luck, he's got to be pretty big. It's they got this. The government already knows about him. They got him specced. He's in high school right now. They already got him. Wait, no, he's like he would be in middle school at that point. They already got a stat sheet. They know the kid. They NFL got, conspiracy. They know everybody. They got this ice cream. It literally makes you thinner as you eat it. It's crazy, and it tastes just as good as the real stuff. And oh, it it's frozen yogurt. It's gonna be <laughs> everywhere in the early 2000s. <coughs> they got this ice cream for astronauts. That's a bunch of bunch of circles, like freeze dried circles. Call them dipping dots. Crazy. <laughs> Those are already available, Tony. <laughs> Fuck you, <Right>. all they <laughs> <laughs> Shit! Ice cream of the future. <laughs> Shit! The public got them. <laughs> I was sold a bad bill of goods. Somebody talked. <laughs> Which one are you talking? He pulls out a Who gun. Who sold them Dippin' Dots? <laughs> Fuck, told about Dippin' Dots. And now it's a failing company. <laughs> Much to my chagrin, because I love Dippin' Dots. I love Dippin' Dots! Unfortunately, they can't keep them in stores because the way they're frozen with liquid nitrogen and all that shit, yeah. it needs to stay, like, really, <laughs> really fucking cold. Yeah. Ugh. I'm glad they're still available. We like, thought by the year 2000, <laughs> Keeping things cool with Nitro would be easier. Would have been easier. It happened in Terminator. It should be everywhere by now. Yeah, come on, man. I mean, the government already got Terminators. Already got it. They already got Terminators. Google, Google, the Google Nator. The Google, <laughs> Google sold them the Terminator. What's Google, you ask? It's this young startup company that's gonna be real big in a few years. It'll be the next Yahoo. <laughs> It'll be crazy. Maybe as big as Yahoo. Maybe. Just remember that. Remember, Yahoo was once bigger than Google. I, I know that. I remember that. I remember there was a war between Ask.com, Ask, yes, Jeeves, Ask Jeeves, Lycos, Yahoo, and Google. That's right. And Google eventually just crushed them. Yeah, I think it was around when I was in uh, sixth or seventh grade where, like, Ask just started failing. And we're like, oh, these things can go away. <laughs> Everybody, like, it, it, it's, Ask Jeeves was, like, the number one search engine in my school for one reason. Are you gay, Jeeves? <laughs> <laughs> I love that you had to formulate a question. Like, you, every search query had to be a question. Yeah, make it as inconvenient as possible. <laughs> Lo and behold, did not win as a business strategy. Yeah. When my older brother and I were looking up porn on the internet in our younger days, he was convinced that if you go through a search engine, mom and dad will never find it in the history. Yeah. So we'll be fine. As long as they don't type in B. <laughs> and then boobs shows up. So we were like, just oh, ask oh. Jeeves. If we ask Jeeves about it, Jeeves is cool. He won't tell Jeeves mom and dad. Jeeves got the hookup. <laughs> Jeeves, will you tell my mom and Little dad? Little do you know, <laughs> it's because your mom and dad won't look up ass Jeeves. <laughs> I just want to imagine a kid typing to Jeeves, Jeeves, question, will you tell my mom and dad if I search up boobs, question mark? Yes. 
<laughs> no. Here you go, kid. Here you go, kid. Don't tell your mom I gave these to you. What you looking? Not because Jeeves. You remember that smug asshole? He, he knew. He knew all that. I shit. bet Jeeves was into some weird porn, honestly. Just look at that. I, mean, I, I, I am genuinely afraid to have a child because I know that day will come when they start like you know getting the, the internet and the search for naked 14 year old girl is going to pop oh, up no. because That's they're gonna be because they're like because 12, 14 I know. and they'd be like what it's my age but it's gotta be on my on fucking your... computer Ooh, you're right exactly oh, that's why right out of the gate you give them a computer exactly like, day one and then you look up the child <laughs> <laughs> set that precedent early yeah because we're they're already gonna have their chip implant when they're born so you just you use to take the tiny little hands yeah, just, just remember when you get your neural chip inserted in the year 2030 when you're able to just look up the internet by closing your eyes and thinking about it I had a thought. And you other. accidentally have a rogue thought. Yeah, one of those thoughts like, man, no, what if I thought no, about it? No, no, no! <laughs> and then your brain is just erased. So many naked grandmas, why? <laughs> but uh, I had the thought, you know what would be a tough existence? Being a teenage boy going through puberty as a nudist. Because there's no way to hide once you start getting yeah. a rocker. <laughs> yeah. I, th I think the entire idea of like nudists has is kind of like, faded out a lot. Yeah. Like, there are still naturalists out there, but it's, it's not, like, between. yeah. I think it's just more that it's just stopped being, like, as, I guess, public isn't the word, because I guess it wasn't a super public thing to begin with. But, like, I, I think it's just that they've kind of just recluse into their own... It's. It, I think it became. It was more prominent when it became almost impossible to see pictures of naked people because yeah. it was just. Now that the internet has exposed all of this. The purpose, their existence, is like they have no merit almost at this yeah. point. So it's just like you know. I mean, you could do it for yourself, but for the curious like people that just want to see it for others, like that's gone. Like, right. Whatever. Yeah. Also, Wanda is just chewing through these fuckers, and there's this bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Who we, I guess, decided was possessed by a Grimer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's right. Yeah, they had had to have. Uh, and I did look up that that little image set of Grimer, just like this one, like someone yeah. has a gun. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's the same on the Riding on the roller, the roller coaster. coaster. Woo! I love you, Grimer. I'm gonna get a Grimer. That's what we're gonna do on this episode. I promise you, maybe. This episode specific. This episode specific. We're gonna get yeah. Around right now is when we decide. Mission Grimer is a go. <laughs> Drop everything. Get Grimer. <laughs> Drop everything. Get Grimer. Wanda, eat that ghost. We gotta get, move. Get Grimer to the Greek. We'll get him. We'll get him there. <laughs> uh, Just tearing our way through these trainers, having little to no problem, feeling like, man... Yeah, our, big, our biggest problem right now is the fact that we're like, how much PP do we have left on bite? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Can we keep this going? Can Wa Does Wanda have a big enough stomach for this? <laughs> Because yeah. we don't want to overfeed her. Because that's how I killed my goldfish. Oh, that's terrible. It ate itself to death. <laughs> goldfish are stupid, man. I know, but they have like a four second memory. They're like, oh, food. I haven't <laughs> ate food in forever. Uh, a friend of mine's goldfish, we called it, tried to run away. <laughs> Did it come and like hop out of the ball? Hopped out of the like, ball. Yeah. It was like flopping around. <laughs> yep. We were like, dude. You're such a bad pet owner, your goldfish tried to <laughs> run away. The worst, uh, like, g fish experience I ever had, uh, with pet fish, that is, is my parents used to have this, like, nice aquarium in their bedroom. You know, it looked really cool. I'm guessing my dad got it because he wanted to, like, look at it at night and be like, yeah, look at all those cool fish we got. I don't know. thinking of <clears throat> Yeah. But uh, one day, I was just kind of, like, sitting around their room, because uh, I think that's where the family computer was at the time. And I just yeah. hear, I hear this splashing. Mm. Like, the fish is just, like, jumping around there. I'm like, okay, what's going on? So I go and look at this fish. He's just jumping in and out of the water, like, playing. I'm like, oh, that's kind of cute. So I'm watching, and he jumps. And he gets sucked into the air purifier. Oh, yeah. no. And it's just it's like stuck in the tube for a little bit, just wriggling. And I'm like, oh my god, can I save him? And I like start like trying to open it up. But, but then like the air pressure late. finally goes and just impales him on the part where the water gets filtered in. So all of a sudden just all this fish blood, blood just squirting no. through there. How and I'm just like, oh my god! How old were you when you saw this live action horror movie? <laughs> I was like seven. God. Oh my god! Yeah, I, and that's why I'm the man I am today. <laughs> I don't even know if I knew what blood was when I was seven. Oh, I, I was, because I had I had probably the most gnarly road rash my, where my shoelace got caught in the chain of a bike and Ooh. I was going downhill. 
so the bike just was pulling me for the ride, and it was, oh, it was awesome. It was great. Showed everybody at school. <laughs> I was like, man, look at this. Yeah, I had to get my face reconstructed. <laughs> oh. You don't even recognize me anymore. You probably think I'm a stranger and you're talking to these people you don't even know. Nah, I've always been really fucking weird about death, I'll be honest. Like, uh, I, but bear in mind, I uh, had, by the age of five, I had been to like three or four funerals, so I was no, no. stranger to it. Yeah. I had already lost a few dogs and a cat at that point. And I those feel. are the fucking hardest when yeah. you're young. So, like, death and me, like, I am much, much more, like, equipped to handle that kind of loss right because yeah. i made peace with it at such an early age that being said the funniest death <laughs> that right, i ever go. experienced comedy death. was we were driving down the road and uh like there's this herd of peacocks on the side of the road oh boy. and right. uh, i like your angle me and my me and my best friend at the time john uh, we were, uh, I don't know why I decided to say his name, like it fucking matters, like that lying fucker Tony. Uh, <laughs> but, we were, we were, we were driving down the road, me and my friend were just talking, and then I'm looking out, I'm like, oh, look at all the birds, and then, like, something, like, spooks them, and they start flying across the road, and all of a sudden, just one hits the windshield, and she goes, BAH! That's the last noise it makes. BAH! <laughs> And I'm just silent for a second, and then I just start cracking up with, like, I'm just cracking up because this bird's... Just this combination of it running in front of the car and that sound just made me fucking crack up. That's some of it. I love it. My my one of my one of my favorite experiences with that was um we had aquatic frogs. You know those like white frogs. And we're gonna dig through a gym real quick. Yeah, we're digging through the gym going back. We Making had a, a mess. We had aquatic frogs that um I had like a really big one and a really tiny one that we had for like I don't know like half a year or so. I wake up one day and they're gone. I'm like, they're in a tank, and we had a, like, books on top of the shelf. Where did they go? We couldn't find them. Like, they were just gone for a long time. We're getting ready to move. Oh, no. A year uh -oh. later. And, <laughs> and there's so, a little frog family. They're all living we're ruining the really... bookshelf. We're ruining everything. Not there. We move in my room on the second floor of the house. Behind my bed is a crispy, dried out little frog. Oh. And we're like, that poor what thing. happened? How did it? Because we're like, they're aquatic. They don't get out and they don't hop. They yeah, breathe. they don't jump out of it. No, because we had to transfer them to a tiny tank whenever we're like, because they, they breathe like, through water. And I was just like, how did you? You're a champ, little guy. I'm like, no, you, you died admirably. You I can't stay with this fucker anymore. <laughs> I gotta like, yeah, go. I can't stand this fucking asshole. We're climbing out of here. And I was like, you know what? That's, I can't even, can't even be sad. Good on you. Your ya. aquatic frog is just talking to his aquatic friend buddies, and he's just like, I hear there are frogs that live on the land. <laughs> I'm gonna be one of those. See you guys. Yeah, and just to repent myself a little bit for laughing as a five-year-old at a dying bird, <laughs> these days, I will literally swerve on the road if I'm about to hit anything. Oh, like, I, I've always been that way. I've, I've, like, I, I literally put my car, like, in the middle of kind of a busy road, I put my car in, like, just pulled off to the side of the road when I see a turtle walking on the road. I'm the same way. Yep. I, I put my hazards on, I tur turn off, okay. look both ways, and I run out uh, and I grab the, the turtle. turtle. I'm like, back, let's yeah. get you onto the... Hey, Sabrina, how you doing, girl? Oh. Yeah, we discovered Sabrina has the cutest sprite. Definitely. All of them. By far. I remember in Red and Blue, she had a whip, and I, I'm wondering where that mm. was. I would not say Sabrina's cute, I'd call her sexy. I'd say yeah. for the sexy one. Alright. Cute, I would say is Eric. I, I, could, I could agree with that. Now see, but like, I would say cute would be Misty, and... See, oh, the, okay. the thing about Sabrina is she has that, like, corset thing yeah. going. Yeah, exactly. And it's just like, it, it at, as a kid, like, as a uh, kid about to blossom into <laughs> puberty, might play this. The budding sexuality of the Pokemon. Yeah, it, when, it's, when it's accentu what's it, when it's accentu uh, accentuating the parts of the body that it is. Sorry, I got a little bit of a stuffy nose. I'm sorry to enunciate You're that. You're good. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it, it kind of helps, helps reinforce the... I don't know if I talked about this, but we all saw the Pokemon card with Misty, like, naked embracing Naked the holding the star Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah absolutely. That, that, I think, I had a sexual awakening looking at that. Like, it's like, what... Why is because, this on a kid's like, car? I was like, I really want this car, so I can have it. Look, I just, I was the same way when I was like a little kid, like, I'd see a magazine, like, the uh, Sports Illustrated, like, swimsuit edition, I was like, I kind of want to get that. And of course, my my mom was cool, like, she wouldn't bring it up, but she knows for a fact, you don't fucking like sports. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. No, I'm really interested in... I, I just really want to know about... 
<laughs> Fuck, there aren't any articles. Here, so. <laughs> yeah, I, I wish I could pinpoint the moment in my mind where nudity went from being funny to sexy. Cause like, I know, I'm trying to think Cause like, at first it was like, haha, like you can see that girl's butt, that's funny. Yeah. And then it went, you can see that girl's butt. That's awesome. hot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just, oh, I don't know when. I'm trying to think. I know it was a fucking anime because I was a weeb child. And I'm trying to think of what it was. My first real awakening was actually when I was uh, five. I know, really. No, early I on. had. No, I was also an early. Boomer. My dad hid Playboys in the bathroom that was like right next to my bedroom. Ooh. Oh man! So like one day I was looking for uh, something under the sink, and I noticed this stack <laughs> of magazines hiding Some under toilet like toilet a toilet bottle toilet. of toilet cleaner or something, which I didn't feel like drinking at the time. So <laughs> I let that go. Good. <laughs> We, I, I have absolutely no idea, but you she doesn't anymore. Supposed to be a Koga's gym. Anyway. <laughs> uh, so I'm like, oh, and my first issue that I ever picked up was the, uh, I think it was the 1995 Drew Barrymore issue. Oh, man. Yeah. Girl Next Door. Mm -hmm. All right. And uh, I, I got like immediately into that. Like, <laughs> why is why is that doing that? I don't get it. Why why is this so appealing to me? Alex Kazan, level forty three. Little scary. Little scary. This is where we're like, oh, where nerves kind of set in for a second because it's probably faster than anything we have right now. But hey, we'll try. Hold mine, and we're like, uh, oh shit, that's probably not good. Oh. Hopefully this kills it. But hey, wait, Wanda, bite you, is special. You got a bite. You shit. Can, oh. <laughs> Oh, and just up its special defense. And Wanda's special attack already kind of the bottom of the barrel. Yep. So I was like, all right, we all need right, to use we'll, physical we'll try, we'll try, we'll try, we'll try oh, super power. No! Okay, I got the psychic. It's getting a psychic. Oh! It's okay. And it comes to special defense, so Wanda, Wanda might, might need to tag out here. Just a little. But, but fuck, now look at that! Look at that secret power! Now we have to gamble, because I mean, we know it goes first. We know it goes first. But, it but we say fuck it, and let's get, get, get yeah. it out. <laughs> Bork. Like, it's right. Bork laser time. You know who can handle the psychic? Bork. Bork, bork. <laughs> bork has the Bork brain too small. No deal, psychic. <laughs> oh, oh you want it? Using a second hyper potion. It's got a second hyper potion and I'm allergic to bullshit. But it Sorry. doesn't matter. <laughs> it's going to calm its mind and we're yeah. like, we're, we're a little antsy at that point. It's like, oh shit, it just did that twice. Bork's got good special defense, but is it that good? Fuck it, let's suplex this son of a bitch and see like, what we oh, can do. No problem. Unless the psychic just uh, destroys him. Uh, now I'm gonna miss oh you! Jesus, oh this is way closer than it should have been, Suplex but... Suplex him! Out of here! Break his neck and steal his spoons and sell them for the silver <laughs> yeah. that they're worth. We ate him. him with his own spoons! <laughs> this boss shocks me! Hey, Sabrina, we'll uh, catch you later, girl. Yeah, hey. Hit us up. Give me your number. You gonna be around here? And I have the Marsh Badge, you know, in Saffron City. <laughs> so if anybody wants to do, like, a fan art of Sabrina and Lakeeger's wedding, go for it. Uh, yes, please. Because she used Future Sight, and it looks bright. <laughs> <coughs> and then we decided to tear up her gym, because we're like, ah, we're not going through another teleporting puzzle. Smell you later, <laughs> Sabrina. <laughs> Wife. We'll just burrow out of here. Which I thought was also annoying, that we'd have a t huge teleporting puzzle at the... Silphco. Yeah, and then immediately, and then immediately after. after teleport but I mean, come on, where the would they have gotten the teleport pads? They got it from yeah, Silphco. It's right down. It's right across the road. Just go and buy it. Like you, you, you don't even have to pay retail for it. You're I'm buying it direct. It retail, as in they're everywhere. As in I can just go, hey, be right back. I'm just gonna teleport to school. I'm so, hey, if the technology exists, you can buy it. I'm just saying. So you have a PlayStation 15? <laughs> Tony, like, I'm, I'm trying to get back in contact with him to see if I can get that. I was gonna say, for all- Yeah, for that'd be really good for the gaming channel. If we it could really have would PS15 be. circa 1999. And just ima <laughs> imagine what they're up to now, though. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, uh, the, the PlayStation moniker's already gone. It's the U station. I was, I was gonna yeah. say, there's no more numbers. The X, the, the the X station. The X station. U. U. <laughs> Yeah, all, all, oh, oh, good old, good old Bill Ted getting out and stretching oh, his no, wings please, for a while. Oh no, please, leave me! Don't leave me in here! I just did such a good job. I just got them out. <laughs> Don't leave me in here with these bastards. Don't worry, you can, you can hang out with Beezy. Striker. Oh. Hey, hey, buddy, man. it's been a while, hey, man. Remember when we were in a party together, bro? Yo, it's me, Dwayne, the most electric <laughs> <Pokemon> <laughs> the most electric <laughs> man in Pokemon <laughs> Entertainment. He's just everybody, crying. Everybody. <laughs> Everybody remembers Dwayne! <laughs>
One day we're just going to pull him out just to self-destruct. <laughs> that's that's the only way he can go. He's got his movie role, and it's no stunt double. Well, hey, we've got a that. fire gym coming up, and we can use all the help. Oh, that's true. <gasps> we actually totally could bring him out and, like... Dwayne might go out the Thinking about it, where we end up here, it would actually be a good place to bring him out. It would be a good place to bring him out. As long as nothing self-destructs on him there. <laughs> well... <laughs> Considering the propensity for that <laughs> with the Mons there, I don't know, maybe. This is, I think, where we had our debate of where we wanted to go yeah. after we, uh... Well, we were like, alright, everyone down here is gonna be water types, so... Oh, this is where we yeah. also bring up the the idea that there is one other Pokémon that we can use. Yeah, yep. and I think, I think we came to that conclusion after this fight. Yeah, because yeah. you mentioned... <laughs> You mentioned that uh, quads will eventually fizzle out, so yes. he cannot get his final form. I know we can, we can do all sorts of goofy things to trade. Yeah, we, 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 are, we will but not, because we do not want to taint the experience. sanctity yeah. of the, the Nuzlocke. Run, no. yeah. So we begin questioning, do we have someone who would be a better, perhaps a dedicated electric type? Is there one that the Heralds have spoken of in Legends? One that we potentially already thought of and just kind of left in a box <laughs> and abandoned with everyone else in there. One that we could have gotten for free. So fuck Voltron. We need to get Skronk out. You get Skronk, you boy. Little 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 Skronky, little Skronky screw. <laughs> and we're like, okay, so let's go back because quads. I do love you, buddy. You were and the we will supreme. probably see you later, but not this day. No, I do love you, quads, but I think that it's time for someone else. Like we talked about the electric type that we just don't have that would be really good to have. Because <laughs> like the finger starts on Voltron, and we're like, an nope. electric type. We don't have an actual electric type. So. <laughs> yeah, look how sad and dejected <laughs> he looks. Like, look at his little face. I'm right. Zoom here. in on that shit. Just oh. I'm right here, man. It's, it's that crook in his other eyebrow. It's like. Oh. <laughs> like, just leave it right there, just cool. Thank God we have this electric type Eevee. <laughs> yeah. Voltron's over like, hey! hey and, we had the, and we had the stone right there and ready for it. I can evolve into something as fast as Jolteon. Uh, who? Ah. And here we are talking about shoving the stone up yeah. uh, Eevee's butt. And just makes all the hairs works. go on end. Yeah, it's, it's really uncomfortable by it, so what? all his hairs get really yeah. jaggedy while it absorbs into the anus. Yeah, because he can't eat the Thunderstone. There's only other one way to get it inside. Good news! <laughs> it's a suppository. And Skronk, uh, loving it. Look also lost it its tail. Ah! Ah! Whoa! Yay! The tail had to make way for more spikes. Jolteon. And then we're like, do we have anything it can know? But what wait a does minute. it know? Does it know any electric moves? Not yet. And we don't have any, I don't think we had any surely that we, we could teach a, it. Surely we have a TM. We use we one of them on teach quad it. slash. We can teach it. Giga Dream, please. Oh, no, no, nope. No. Oh, boy. We need to teach Snatch to Wanda. <laughs> <laughs> Give her that second bite. <laughs> <laughs> More teeth. Ugh. Can anybody learn Toxic? That's a movie we should see if somebody can learn. We, this I remember like we were shocked that Bork record. could not learn Calm Cal Mind. Yeah, because he can learn Psychic and I figured that's his thing, man. He's always calm. Oh, oh man. Bork, his, Bork his knows how to chill. His brain is always a torrent of rage <laughs> and madness. But he's so chill. It just happens so much that he can't function properly. So it just like comes across as he's lethargic. Yeah. Hey guys, what's going on? Help Johnny Cash, go meet everybody. I like to imagine that everyone in the box is like pissed. And this is like, you know, you go to the, the dregs, the back alley where yeah. all the rejects hang out. And they're just like, oh, they're, they're nice of you to show up, Johnny boy. I like to think of it that they all essentially worship Lekeager and want his favor. Oh, but, okay. then there, but then there are some in the box who we've never used and they don't even think Lekeager really they're exists. Out there, yeah. They're out there they're smoking. Like, there is no trainer. Are you, you keep telling yourself that lie. <laughs> but people keep coming in and they know the trainer. They've been with him. No. You it's can't put him true. in a... Have you put the trainer in a box? He doesn't exist. Can you put him in a beaker? <laughs> Can you put him in a ball that he's not real? <laughs> Can you put that ball in a ball? Not a real ball. So at this point I go, wait a minute. Yeah, let's just we go can, buy We some can buy spells. the TM for Thunder. 
because, like, you can buy all the other powerful ones, so surely we can buy this one. And I remember positing, you know, it'd probably be quicker just to walk up and down the stairs than go up <laughs> one floor in the elevator. Wrong! But uh, Lakeiger is tired. Yeah, he's, he's... So he's gotta use that elevator. Given his, uh, you know... Going his... through two splash, the three splash screens instead of one. Given his disposition for teleport, I like to say he's probably lazy. I will just throw that out there. <laughs> He could have just walked. Yeah, he digs digs through a gym. <laughs> yeah. so, okay, we're gonna to walk back down. down. The <laughs> like, okay, fine, never expect. I'm like, oh, maybe they maybe they got it here. So like, alright, here, here we go. Here we go. High beam break breaks. Uh, oh. oh. I was like, oh, okay, maybe like, it's the other guy. Maybe yeah. the other guy has these the must elemental. Be all the stuff. Yeah, you yeah, got all the ones. Even hyper beam was clearly. He's got the there. elemental. Oh, okay, no, no, he has a uh, nothing. Good one. Well, so I am concerned at this point going, I could have sworn you could buy Thunder. I feel like you've been able to buy Thunder in every game. And then we're like, hey, let's go up to the top floor. We haven't checked there yet. So, yeah, 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 we can take the elevator for that. Uh, uh, no, I'm saying something. Options. Hey, that would be yeah, a great let's idea. The, uh, let's go the stairs. <laughs> <laughs> Speed run strats. You have to discuss everything. Catching lightning in a bottle twice. I hear these two guys. Maybe they've got it. No. No. Nope. They it's got, got really expensive vitamins. Vitamins are expensive. Man. I like they how are, you man. walk all the way to the dude's mat instead of talking to him. <laughs> the other. We're child. courteous. We're not gonna be like, hey, <laughs> <laughs> yo, over here. Ugh, you gonna make me turn? Like, all right, dick. we can't, we can't like, elevator. Oh, may as well go well, buy some lemonade for over here. Limonades. What does it have? And then at this point, I am frantically looking on my phone. TM Thunder Leaf Green? Question. Jeeves? Boobs? <laughs> <laughs> no, Jeeves, not, not today. <laughs> Does Ask.com still a thing? I think so. Now I need to look that up. I think it is. <laughs> Google, is Ask.com ask 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 still a thing? <laughs> I want to be snarky and be like, yeah, unfortunately. <laughs> Ask.com still a thing. <laughs> What's your response, Google? I like how it's uh, the suggestion was, is Ask Jeeves still a thing? Because <laughs> that's what it was, it was Ask Jeeves! Alright, Ask.com still exists. Okay, ask it a question. Is oh no, it's there? a question for me. Oh, oh right, what's, the, what's the question? How many eyes does a grasshopper have? It looks four. like it's an educational site now. It's got four. Guess, guess four. Oh, I'm guess right. four. Four is incorrect. Uh, is it... A grasshopper has five eyes, because they are freaks. <laughs> Yeah, weird. Including two compound eyes and three simple eyes. Three simple eyes. Oh, simple. They're simple. They're, simple. They're just know, simple eyes. Like us, us dumbass. Normal ass, ass regular yeah. light catching <laughs> frames in our eye, lenses in our face. <laughs> Fucking dumb eyes. The compound eyes are made up of many separate lenses that work together to form a picture. What of which the is an ass? The compound <laughs> eyes are used to see, but scientists are uncertain how a grasshopper uses its simple eyes. Considering it's attached on its asshole. They're just too simple. They're too simple to function. Too simple. Can't even do maybe, it. Maybe they're slow, maybe it's an evolutionary thing and they're slowly phasing out. That seems like the way to do ask is make it a trivia centric site. Yeah. yeah. That seems like what you could do. Uh -oh. At this point I realize, oh wait, Thunder is at the power plant. And then I go, wait, we can access the power plant now because we have All we have to do is go up to Cerulean. But yeah, because we, we passed the area that the power plant was at. We're like, well, we need Surf to go there. Now we have Surf, so let's go! Yeah, All we, can ride, we, can, we can ride on Wanda's back like most of this playthrough. <laughs> Just carrying us. There was a solid third where she was not There was. Us. There yeah, was no, a there good was a, chunk of time. Well, it was through the, that. It, it was the Dark Ages. <laughs> through this gem is where she, like, kind of reclaimed her power. It was through, yeah, yeah, pretty much. Small Johnny. Our extra flying type. Johnny, my boy. Them. See Rather, you, Bill Ted. You'll be one of the few third stage evolutions we get to see. <laughs> Yeah, he I, and I remember there were. Uh, I also remarked that there were a couple of options we had should he gain that third head. Uh, one is one that I was kind of a fan of, Larry Curly and Mo. Yeah, okay. And then there was another one that somebody brought up, Ed Ed and Eddie. I'm a fan of that. I think that's better. I love Ed. Because then you can so just much. name it Ed Boys. <laughs> Ed Boys. Life has many yeah. doors. <laughs> Life has many doors, Ed Boys. <laughs> that's. I was checking the moves, going like, do we really need to go through this place? And then, no, oh, yeah, he knows no electric type moves. Well, let's start the quest of Strong. Time to get Strong Strong. 
up that up that scroll. They still haven't cleaned up their place after it got ransacked. For real. Dig yeah, I remember get us that, we were talking about- Get your about... shit together. Hold on, gotta use Snap. I remember we were talking about the police force and how ineffective they were earlier this episode. And then we go there, I'm like, and the detective's still in that one house. Yep. And the fucking there criminal was. ran away. Here we are, like, noobs taking the wrong track. We were like, it's is, down this here, the right? Right? is this the and right go, one? Oh, God no. damn it. No. I like how we even paused. Like, is this right? right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, instead of going, just wait. So I want to look like a dummy. <laughs> it's okay, I'm... you got a sick jump. Yeah, I know. Woo! BMX jump in them here. dunes. And you're like, down here? And I go, no. That's the where water. We <laughs> that's where we went before. Here we are, jumping on the back of Wanda. Wanda this carries is where we're victory. discussing whether or not, like, getting to the water means, like, it's a new route. I don't think I would say, we, I would say I, no. I, I feel like the... fishing is okay, but I don't think, like, well, fishing surfing should... surfing Here's yeah. the thing. I will say that as we surf to seafoam, that is the one route. Well, of course. Yeah, that's like, a route. That's a route. There, instead of grass, it's all water. But I mean, like, if, if you have water on a route and there's grass, I don't think you can both surf and... I don't... See, here's the thing. I wouldn't see why you couldn't if fishing is allowed, although we have not fished... Like, we fished once know. in Safari Zone, and we have that one... Do we have Sea King? I don't know if we caught him. No, we uh, fucked that up. Okay, yeah. That was the one time we fished. I, don't even I, feel, like, well I feel like we fished a couple of times in there, because that was right when we got the Super Rod. I think we did it once. I thought like we just got to look at Sea King. We're like, okay, that's, that's fishing here, and then that was. Because I thought we fished once and we found something that we already had, and then we just didn't. I you you might you might be right. Regardless, I don't see us fishing probably ever, considering we have Gyarados, and if she dies, Lapras. So yeah. those are probably the best. Like Wanda I in April. Yeah. The killer tag team. Mm hmm. I don't even remember what he said he had, but we were like, what are we going to do? And then, uh, like, whatever. Well, we'll, yeah, we want strong like, yeah, XP. Yeah. get some levels and, and then switch out. start leveling up, because eventually... Because nothing he has can hurt anything else we have. No. Yeah. All right, can you take him? No. No, probably not. So we'll throw out... Big, I think it was Bork. Dumbass tongue of his. Because we always like Bork. Oh, or maybe we threw out... Yeah, Johnny. Johnny. Johnny, because Johnny needs the levels. Yeah, Johnny needs the levels. Yeah. Unless we did something completely different, in which case, I don't know. No, it's just John, John, or, or, or maybe we just hit me. Now. Yeah, there we go. Well, let's, uh, let's see where this goes. Hold on, I'm interested. Uh, uh, yeah. uh, I love its squats. Yeah. Uh, uh, uh. I assume it's curling its tongue around itself, and that's the defense curl. Now, is... but, you see, like like any post, you're just like, <laughs> gonna freeze that thing to something. Knock it off! You shoot your eye out, kid, come on. I don't understand why Licky Licky, Licky exists and why it looks so dumb. Licky Licky is kind of the worst designed Pokemon. Oh like, wait, that's that's the Lickitung with like of evolution. The big, yeah, wow, yeah. oh, that's ugly as shit. No, I think those. I, I thought it was made up for the longest time until I ran it into one. Looks in the game. like a bad like fan made thing. No, yeah, the worst, the dumbest Pokemon. You know what? It might have been one of those stupid contests. Like. I don't, I don't remember they, there were. I don't think they, no, I don't think they use any of those. No, they oh, don't. They never use like one. They, no, they they expressly say do not send us Pokemon designs because they don't, don't want to have to do with copyright them. shit if yeah, an artist yeah, they, has a design. Yeah, they don't want to accidentally make something that looks like something someone wants sent them. <laughs> That's fair. And now we're like, okay, so now we can catch something in here. So let's send something up front that we can actually catch with. Yeah, because he has he still has Thunder Wave, so he's our catcher. Really. And we're like, shit, we could find Electro Buzz. Fuck. Fuck uh, this! Hopefully it works. I don't fuck know. Fuck this Jolteon bullshit. Oh, oh no! Man. Don't worry. Same type. We've already caught one of them. We've already caught. We one, don't so. need this shit. No. We're gonna murder it. Let's get out of here. Get, get that Pokeball out of my face. Uh, so we have. Uh, remember that death we mentioned? Uh, it's a sad time. It's been, it's been fun, Johnny. We got paralyzed, and as soon as that happened, we thought, we're well, like, oh, maybe surely we got everything this. will be fine. Maybe we got this. Oh shit! Oh shit! Maybe we, yeah, Maybe we got this. Maybe we got this. And okay. then we killed the Voltorb. Killed the Voltorb. So just sorry. I'm really sorry that had to happen. But, uh, hey. but you know what? I mean, it, it was it was really just a matter of time until we killed a Voltorb. So <laughs> <laughs> yeah, honestly, it, it had to happen. Long. So we needed to uh, paralyze, heal. You know, make sure he's make all sure he's healthy all good. and good. And uh, we needed to find that Electabuzz. And you can find out if we find that Electabuzz next time on TFS Plays Pokemon Leaf Green Nuzlocke when we actually record it live again. Sorry Woo, about all this. Goodbye! 
Oh boy, I am sorry for the delay everyone, but I hope you understand after hearing how that sounded. I hope you guys enjoyed it. This has been your Leaf Green Nuzlocke, hour long installment. Sorry it's a little late, but hey, you know what? What else are you doing on a Sunday? You're doing nothing. You're watching Pokemon. You're having a great time. Leave a like if you guys enjoyed it. Let us know. And if you want to stay tuned for the next installment, make sure to stay subscribed. On the left side of your screen, you'll see a button that has Takahata 101's face and Zito, our new boy's face, over here playing Nekopara as they're going to play some dating sims. Check it out over here on the left. And on the right, you can check out our casual stream from last Friday where we play a bunch of shoot-em-ups. It's pretty fun. Have a great rest of the day, guys. Take care.